yeah, it um it'll make a nice change from from the the cool North County. Um, absolutely looking forward to it. Yeah. It's been a while since I've played with a red ball, so um really excited. Um, it'll obviously pose a, a different challenge. Um. It's it's nice that the the white ball games are first up, just to you know get settled in, and I suppose we're we're more used to the white ball cricket now at this stage. Um, but yeah, absolutely buzzing for the red ball games. Um, it's really exciting part of my game that I'm really looking to develop, and you know hopefully play some test cricket soon. So yeah, really excited. It's something that I've done in the past, and um, you know it's it's really exciting, and um, it poses a different challenge, and um, you're kind of in the hot seat a little bit, and um, but we've got such a young team, and um, so it'll be really exciting, you know, to hopefully show the youngsters the ropes, and um, yeah, I suppose lead from the front, lead by example. And um, I found out through Whitey, he gave me a call a couple of months back just to, you know, let me know about what the winter was like, and. Um, what my what the plans were for me going forward and stuff and i think getting games under my belt and you know taking a little bit more of a leadership role and um, a little bit more responsibility is something that the the coach and selectors want me to do and i'm absolutely delighted to do it absolutely fantastic and um, you know h has a great cricket brain um He's very specific in in what he wants out of us and what he wants us to do, which which makes training and preparation really easy and exciting. But um, yeah, it's really just uh, he's very keen to install us just playing some games and um, you know hitting our straps early and hopefully touch down and um, yeah put a right foot forward from the beginning. Really good, um, really good. We've we've spent a good, quite a bit of time in North County. Um, obviously, the colder months now, it's it's hard to get outdoors. But we've had a good six, seven week block since the end of the season to to really hone in on our skills. Um, we've got we've had a good gym block as well with with Brendan. And um, yeah, I feel like we're first anyway, um, fit and ready to go. Keen to get out there. Absolutely in the hot seat. Um, now look, it's it's really exciting, and um, it's kind of where you want to be at. You know, it's the best place to learn and develop. And wick keeping is obviously an element of my game as well that I'm that I'm keep trying to push on and um, hopefully gives me the best chance of playing for Ireland. But um, yeah, it'll it'll be a challenge, of course, and um, always is. But uh, captaincy will be fun too. And um, that's another part of my game that I'm trying to expand. And you know, I've done it a little bit before in club cricket and youth cricket and it's it's an element of my game that I really I really enjoy and um, kind of gives you a different perspective of the game and yeah it's it's exciting. Actually didn't know about that, but um, yeah I, I think I am reasonably happy yeah, where my game is at. You know it's it's probably just a case now of having been dropped from the, from the ODI team. It's I kind of had to go back to the drawing board a little bit and you know, uh, kind of try out a few new things and and take a little bit of criticism, which is which is always great. But I feel like I'm I've learned and hopefully turned the corner. And um, I think my game's in a pretty good place. And um, it was good to get a few runs in the interpros this year. And um, but hopefully now I can have a successful trip and um, to the West Indies. Is a, is a dream come true, Craig. You know, it's it's something that I've worked for my whole life, obviously. Um, it was really special out in Harare there. Um, got my cap from Dockers, which was great. You know, really close with George. And, um, yeah, no, it was, it was really special and, and good to get out there and, and wear the, the green shirt.